Virgos, what's going on with you this week? Hmm. Oh, wow. Okay. Um, there is talk of a dog coming in for you on Tuesday the 7th. Um, some of you may literally be like picking up a dog or a stray dog may be coming in. It can also be symbolic of loyalty. So you may be learning about a situation in your life right now where you're figuring out if someone has been loyal or you're examining where you should be loyal. Uh, but Friday the 10th actually came, came up. This is about love. This is about literally love, okay, in the romantic sense. So what I see going on with this is an opportunity for you to speak out, for you to speak up. And my feeling with this is that if you find yourself with someone and have been extremely reserved, you run the risk of losing this person by not engaging with them enough. Now, for like half of you almost, it really feels to me like this could not so much be about gift giving or telling them that you love them, but giving them your time. And with your time, it doesn't even have to be really overly engaging because a lot of these circumstances could be remedied by something like watching a movie or, um, you know, taking a, taking a trip out somewhere and just sitting and relaxing, enjoying a sunset. I mean, it's really literally very quiet and peaceful and it's a serene connectedness that needs to happen. You do run the risk of this other person um, sort of looking at you and saying, you know, it's it's almost like a shit or get off the pot type of a situation, quite literally. Like, how long are you just going to sit here taking up space? Are you going to contribute or no? Okay, this is it. Saturday the 11th. I heard take it. Now, take it in this particular situation look very much like a business opportunity that might be intimidating to you. Uh, business, work, promotion, use of your degree, doing anything out of your comfort zone. It feels to me like this um, isn't something that you would have normally done, but because it's being presented to you and offered to you, you're considering it more. And I do think that you should go with this. You'll reap benefits uh, approximately seven months out from now. You'll have a better understanding of the benefits that can come from that. And that's just the beginning of the process. On Sunday the 12th, well, so I had go inward and that there's some dark energy there. You may have some unresolved issues, skeletons in the closet, stuff swept under the carpet. There's some type of unfinished business that you need to get down to and you can't, how do I want to say this? Over the course of the next two weeks, you're going to be repeatedly tested on that. And you can't keep going forward in these different situations, acting like you're okay or acting like you processed all of this. It has to come from removal of the mask and an authentic, introspective time where you did the processing and the work on yourself, okay? Um there is talk on Monday the 13th of someone reaching out to you trying to get some help from you. So whether this is someone younger, someone who just isn't as good um, at it in whatever capacity this is as you are, or this is someone with either a drug addiction, alcoholism, or they are battling depression or some type of an illness called to help. And you really, really do need to give that time okay busy week for virgos it's a lot of change